Hi, I'm Brisket. I'm Josh. And this is Whiskey Chicken, where we give honest reviews from the average Joe's perspective on various whiskeys. We're new at whiskey reviews and tasting, and we'd love for you to come along on the journey. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And also, let us know what you think down in the comments section. So, what whiskey are we going to try today? Today we're going to be trying an Irish whiskey called the Whistler. It's double oaked. It's from the Bowen Distillery in Ireland. And I've never been to Ireland. Have you been to Ireland? I've never been to Ireland myself either. I would love to go someday. A little fun fact about me and Brisket is we've traveled the world together through work. And yeah, it'd be great to do a little more traveling around the world. Try some whiskeys from different places that we can't find here stateside where we're from. For sure. So... When I bought this, I uh, did a little research, and one thing that I was reading is it uh, contains 80% grain whiskey and 20% single malt. All right. Well, something I read about this was that they age this for a year in bourbon barrels, and then they age it for two years in sherry casks. I think that's a little young for a whiskey, but we'll try it. We'll see where it goes. Speaking of young, I was also doing a little research in the... Uh, Master Distiller was the youngest to date in Ireland. Interesting. So. All right. Well. All right. Well, let's let's taste it. All right, man. Let's crack this bad boy open. All right. Work. So right away, I noticed that it's a it's a lighter color whiskey, and I think that that probably comes from the. Uh, the shorter age period, like we talked about, as being a little bit younger whiskey. For sure. So. So this bottle I bought also for, uh, I think I paid like $38 for it. It's not too bad. That's an affordable bottle of whiskey yeah, not for the bad. occasional drink. Now, right away, something I smell, and don't get me wrong, I've never been too into all the precise things with smelling and tasting whiskeys, but... Something I do definitely notice is the uh, is the vanilla. A little bit of vanilla. I do get that. Yeah, I do smell a little yeah. vanilla. A little vanilla, and you definitely get the a lot of grain. The grain. Yeah, you, you smell the grain. grain. You never hear that from anybody, but you can definitely tell this is made from grains <laughs> because we can smell it still. But All right. you can. All right. Let's give it Let's a try. Little oh. taste. very smooth on the front end it's you say smooth i'll say silk silk like silky silky smooth just silky smooth that's silky smooth that's definitely what i get on the front end but i get a little bite on the back end yeah i mean there's there's quite the bite on the, the back end it doesn't stay with you <clears throat> but i definitely i definitely do get some bite from it and that's you know that's all right. I like that in my whiskey. I, I want a little bit of a bite myself. That's the whiskey I like. So, yeah, it's it's consistent from sip to sip. Smooth, silky, with a pretty good, you know, decent bite. Decent bite on the back end. So far as like our review, we're gonna grade it one through five. Just kind of our opinion. We're new to this, and we're learning it as we go. Uh, personally, one through five, I'll give it about 3.5. It was smooth and silky, which I did like, but I, I'm not quite sure it was worth a dollar. What do you think? Uh, I'm, I'm kind of at a three for, for me. I, I liked it. It's a decent whiskey. I just, I think it reaches past that price point, like you're saying. Uh, I, I don't know that I would spend that much money on this particular whiskey. If it was a little cheaper, you said it was $38 for the bottle. Um, I'd say if it was a little cheaper, maybe in the 20s range, I'd spend that money on this bottle. But I feel like it was a little more expensive than I want to spend for something like this. It was smooth, but that bite on the back end, a little more than what I want out of a bottle I spend this kind of money for. For sure, for sure. Uh, so if you try this bottle, let us know uh, how you feel. Is it is it worth the price? Yeah. What do you What do you think? Tell us in the comments. Let us know. So guys, thanks for tuning in and following us along on our journey as we try different whiskeys. And uh, be sure to click that notification bell. 
and like, share, and subscribe. And once again, I'm Josh. I'm Brisket. And this is Whiskey Chicken. Thanks, guys.